and now on S and J TV One, Road Trip. Hello, we are currently in Navata, which is in Spain. You never, you never heard of it? I'm sorry, Joanne, your face is now going to be obscured by a map. But uh, as you can see, there's the UK and Spain. And if we go in a bit closer, we can see Barcelona, where we landed. And then we drove up from Barcelona to Navata, which is close to Figueres. 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 Anyway, but uh, we're over here seeing your parents for Christmas, so um, we thought we'd just uh, get out and have a little drive. We have rented a car, which is this little piece of metal. Metal. What is it? Citroen C1. It's not too bad. It's all right. It takes us to where we want to go. So it makes you drive like a learner driver. <laughs> Lots of high revs. Anyway, he's not a foreign <clears> master. <throat> let me tell you. Anyway, your dad recommended that we should go and see a little village. Yeah, called Yado. Apparently it's a nice little village. We've seen the brown sign that tells us what to see. There's a church. There's always a church to see, isn't there? <laughs> I mean, when isn't there a village with a church? Exactly. It's definitely quiet. Yeah, walking down a say that there's anything when you want to leave here. Walking down a very quiet street. Um it smells of wood fire a little bit. Yes. It's very nice. I can see a church or tower. Just in the uh, in the foreground. I'm coming to another sign that tells us what we can see. So yes. Church of St. Philip's. Oh, and it smells of wood fire around here. Oh, here we are. Lovely, isn't it? This said church. A little bit tacky with mobile phone mast on top, perhaps. And the smashed. Smashed windows. Looks like it's a home to the pigeons, that's for sure. I think the church was deserted. There didn't appear to be any way of getting inside it. Still, it looks pretty enough from the outside, doesn't it? Onwards to the next exciting thing. <laughs> ah, so, as everywhere in Catalonia, the flags of independence, all right? when France was still Catalonia. Look, that's France now. It's quite a nice map. What a nice square. That's the, that's the communal hall. Oh, nice, lovely. What's that? Oh, it'll be the Estrella Dam, Dam land. Lots of lovely beers. Independence. 
bits and pieces. There's the bell of that church we saw just now. And there's the Australia Dam Dam. So this is the church of Santa Maria. Lovely looking thing, isn't it? Nice big yellow ribbon there. But again, the independence. You see that everywhere. Ye olde heart defibrillator down there. Through here. courtyard. So this is nice and cool in the summer. And it's nice and cool now. More olive trees, I believe. There's that church again we saw to begin with. Is a well not sure what you call that. I suppose it does take rainwater away. And more old streets. Hello. Hola. So you have to speak in Spanish to these Spanish dogs. Hello. <laughs> Oh! I think we're done here. I think we've had a little wander around and seen what there is to see. Lovely little place though. It was in the summer. I'm sure this will be bustling with people at cafes and whatever, but being the 27th of December, it's a little bit deserted. But it's very, it has its charm. Yes. We're now going to drive to Figueras. 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 And um, I mean, the main thing to see in Figueras is the Dali Museum, but we're not going to see that because we haven't got enough time. Um, well, it's a nice city to walk around the streets and lots of cafes, and there's a Ramblas as well. Okay. So it's nice. So, and if by magic, we should now appear in Figueres. Oh, and here we are in Figueres. Well, no, we decided not to go to Figueres in the end, and we decided to go to a lot. Where I was going to do my joke about there was a, a lot to see, and then we decided not to go there either. Finally, we've decided to come to, I want to say, Besalu. Yes. yes, and there's the famous Besalu Bridge behind us. There's lots to see and do here. So let's have a little wander around and see this lovely old town village of Besalu. There's nothing you want to say? No. No. You've said it all. Okay. So once you've walked across the, uh, the bridge, you enter, is it medieval? It is medieval, yes. Medieval fields, very narrow streets, cobbled stones. Nice packed, river. packed in the summer, one would feel. But being winter and it's quite a nice time to come now. Yes, it's quite winter quiet. sunshine. <laughs> Not too cold.
So we're just standing looking at the monastery in front of us. But what a nice little area for having a, a coffee or a little something to eat. Lovely little plaza or square. Is that a plaza, have? Andrew? It's a square, plaza. In Capillon Square. Uh, same thing. Let's have a look inside the church. So we were going to go into the church, but we had to pay, which wasn't a problem. We would have done. But all we had was a 50 euro note. And that wasn't going to go down very well, was it? So we're just having a wander. See the pretty, pretty buildings and streets. So we're just having a wander. But there is a, a good map system around here with numbers and points of interest which you could quite easily follow and take nice pictures and read up about it. Each area is in Spanish and English and probably Catalan is it? Catalan first probably being a Catalan area. So we hope you've enjoyed our little video. Next time you come back, we'll be doing a little bit more research perhaps to let you know what we're actually talking about and have longer. Anyway, we shall leave you from Besselou. Until next time, you can like and subscribe. Subscri blah, blah, blah. That didn't work very well, did it? Ah, you can like and subscribe if you like. Too many likes. Anyway, you know what. And if you don't like, don't. Yeah, who cares? We didn't force you to watch it. Toodles. Bye. Thank you.